There we go. I got a new phone holder, so we'll see how that goes. Hopefully it isn't too shaky. It's pretty stout. So anyhow, so what we got going on, I gotta grade this house we're at here. Get on the I don't know if I'm gonna get under there or not. Back up a little bit. And uh, I got some debris here still. I don't know if you guys, I don't know if I posted a video on it. It was of a house I tore down here. And uh, anyhow, so now I'm just coming in. I got some a little bit of debris laying around. I've got, uh, I gotta grade this house. So, um, and whatnot, so we'll see what happens. But we got a lot of work to do this year. We got some uh, some good jobs here coming up. And, uh, just trying to, you know, we're only in March, so it's just trying to get the stuff done before the mad rush of summer comes, but it already feels like we're in summer. But it feels like at least. So. Let me get out of there. So, the other thing, other than that, not much is new, just trying to keep working and get as much done as we can. The only other thing new, we are looking at getting rid of that uh, Honda 160. Uh, we decided it's not the machine we want to keep for long term. I mean, it does well and everything, but it it's just uh, not for us. It, uh, so. We are looking at getting rid of that. Uh, I'm not sure what we're going to get yet. Uh, we talked to a few different dealers. Uh, you know, we did, I've always kind of liked our Cabelcos, of course, so we are looking into that. We're looking into a Link Belt, looking into a Volvo and a John Deere. Uh, really, right now, the biggest thing for us is essentially going to be the buck, the dollar. Whatever, because you know we still owe money on our 160, and um, so kind of right now, kind of whatever gives us the best deal might be the route we go. Um, I mean, obviously, if we are going to demo each hoe if we decide that you know if we're interested in, in buying one of them, we are going to demo them, of course. You know, so unless it demos like real crap, then um, you know we want to get it, but. I don't know. But anyhow, if any of you guys watch this and you got an opinion on it, maybe send a comment and let me know. All of them we'd be looking at are our 160s. Like I said, we'd be looking at a Belco 112, it'd be a Belco 170, or a John Deere 160, or a Link Belt 160, or a Volvo 160. So, if you got a preference on one of those, let me know. Uh, the goods and the bads of it. I'd appreciate that. And, um, so, other than that, that's pretty much it. I need a thumb on this machine. I need, but, uh, oh, we do got another house to tear down here shortly. The house that had caught fire. So we're supposed to try to get that done shortly. Um, we might have a small parking lot to do, about 20,000 square feet. Sounds like they're going to have us do it, but until they sign on the line, you know, nothing's ever set in stone. So, but next week we got two basements to dig. Uh, this week, I to, between this week and next week, I've got the house we're working at. I gotta get the rough grade done here, and I gotta put the septic in. Uh, Friday this week, 
Uh, we're putting a sewer in at a different location. Uh, and then, like I said, we got two basements to dig next week. And like I said, we got to try to get septic in here, too. So pretty much, we've got a full, uh, full two weeks, probably actually two and a half weeks of work. We are going to lose some, though, time because Thursday it's supposed to rain all day, which isn't going to help. See what happens with that. Try to grab that big one right here. Throw this dumpster. Keep it out. I don't want it to fall out and hit my cylinder. Boom. That would be pretty, pretty bad if that were to happen. would not be a happy camper. For sure. Clear that tree. Yeah, I'm getting a branch, but that's alright. You know what? Let me open up that door. Because this one's a little big. Let me open up that door real quick. I'll take it right through the gate.
we do that, I might just go ahead and uh, pick that other stuff up by hand. 